Welcome. This easy to follow instructional video will guide you through how to use the Calyx extraction device to take a fecal sample. About your fecal elastase test kit. Your test. Your healthcare professional has asked you to do an elastase test. This is used to determine how well your pancreas is working and if your body is having trouble digesting food properly. Intended use. A single use, home fecal elastase kit for collection and transportation to the laboratory for analysis. What sample is required? A formed fecal sample, solid or semi-solid, is preferable for this test. Elastase is a digestive enzyme that is naturally passed in the feces if your pancreas is working properly. Avoid using a liquid or watery feces, as it may dilute the enzyme and lead to inaccurate results. If possible, wait until a more formed fecal sample can be collected. In the contents of this pack you will find one Calyx device, the instruction for use leaflet with detachable label, and a clear plastic bag Key things to remember before you start. Do not use the Calyx beyond the stated expiry date. A formed sample is ideal. The fecal sample must not come into contact with the toilet water due to bleaches and disinfectants. Do not get urine in the sample as this will dilute it. Do not unscrew the blue cap or empty the liquid at any time. Watch this entire video and read the provided instruction leaflet carefully before you start. Collect the fecal sample. There are a number of ways to collect your fecal sample. A clean takeaway container, paper or foil plate. Loosely draped cling film placed over the toilet towards the back to form a dip. Do not flush after use a plastic bag or glove covering your hand. Use a solid sample where possible. Prepare the Calyx cap. Hold the Calyx cap tube with the white cap pointing upward. Remove the sampling pin by twisting the white cap and pulling upwards at the same time. Please do not twist or remove the blue cap. Take the sample. Dip the sampling pin into the feces and twist. Repeat this process three to five times in different places in the sample. If you'd like to know how to deal with different fecal consistencies, please follow the QR code for more video instructions. Check the sample. Make sure all the grooves are completely filled on the end of the sampling pin. Reseal the calyx cap. Replace the sampling pin back into the calyx tube and push firmly into the locking position. You will feel and hear two clicks. Do this only once. Once complete, do not remove the sample pin from the tube or repeat the collection process, as this will lead to inaccurate or incorrect results. Label the Calyx device. Please ensure the Calyx tube is clearly labeled with your name, date of birth, NHS number, date of sample collection, and indicate if the sample was liquid, yes or no. Return your sample. Put the Calyx tube and the GP request form into the plastic bag and return as directed to the GP or hospital laboratory as quickly as possible. For more information or further instructions, please visit www.calprotectin.co.uk forward slash elastase. Thanks for watching.